Schools across Northeast Ohio are limping their way to winter break as they finish off 2021 with tight staffing and spiking COVID cases. News 5's Nadine Ambosada tells us some have even canceled classes. As schools are nearing two years in a pandemic, parents like Angela are frustrated. Well, I got a phone call from my son today stating that everyone had to leave the school. Angela's son is a ninth grader at John F. Kennedy High School in Cleveland. When he got to school and sat down in class, the principal came over the intercom. He said all students would be sent home by nine o'clock simply due to the fact that they didn't have enough staff. But the thing is, I didn't get a call from the school, neither a text. Cleveland Metropolitan Schools tell News 5 before school started, a list of staff members called out sick and they did not have the subs to cover, adding the district does have an automatic call and text notification system for situations like this, but Angela says she never received a message. I would like to see them reach out and at least send text or make a phone call when you're releasing children. CMSD is not alone in facing the effects of another COVID surge. Stowe Monroe Falls canceled two days of midterms after multiple students and staff members tested positive. Hudson City Schools basketball teams will not compete or practice the next few days due to outbreaks. In Cuyahoga Heights, their school district superintendent Tom Evans says it's been a struggle. It really, really got tough for us. Attendance averaged in the 90th percentile all year until Tuesday. This past Tuesday, we had uh, about uh, 28 confirmed cases in the district. We're, we're a district of 850 students, so that's a big number for us. Some students will now have to take their midterms during the holiday break, while others won't be able to participate in extracurriculars. This would have been a big weekend for us. Our Hall of Fame induction would have been tomorrow, our luncheon, and our we host the Joe LaBella basketball tournament. We had, to, we had to cancel that or postpone it. Now they're even trying to make plans for the next year. We're going to bring everybody else. Middle school and high school will be masked beginning January 3rd. But of course, it's all in the air. I got out of the prediction business with, with COVID because every time I made a prediction, it was wrong. Reporting in Cleveland, Nadine Busada, News 5.